the man who was marked by winter. He was heading for Bridal Veil Falls, an upward slog on a dusty path. Mid-May and hot as a millstone grinding his shoulders, his back. Each breath was a drowning. And who's to say if it was a mirage, the other side of the creek's brown water? He saw it, that's enough, in the deep shade of a rocky overhang. The spore of winter, a tracery of ice. If we'd reached him, we'd have warned him of the depth, the secret current underneath. He must have been half crazy with the heat. He stripped off, waded in. His feet were cut from under him. He was swept downriver in melt water from the mountain. She clutched him to her breast, that beast of winter. One look from her agate eyes and he abandoned hope. He was pliant. She pulled him under. If she had him once, she had him thrice. She shook his heart and mind asunder. And he would woodenly have gone back to her palace or her lair, whichever, whatever she was. He would have lived forever in her realm of ice.